What is up, everybody? Good guys here. Welcome back to the Sturgeon campaign here in Bannerlord, where we are at war with the Kuzate still, and there is another big battle to be had. Um, let's actually level up a little bit before we head in here. For this battle, I'm going to be focusing heavily on not running my men in to die. <laughs> I definitely did a lot of that the last big battle. I'm going to try to stick with the homies this time. I think that's gonna do me wonders. So we'll see where they go. And we're going with them. Last time I thought we'd be going in, and we were not. And then my men got slaughtered. And now I got a weak ass army. So hopefully we can avoid that. We still want to do a lot of blasting. The more kills we get, the better it looks for us. And be careful with your clicks. You can very easily click the wrong thing and send your men in to die in this new one. So let's have them chill the frick out. Ow. Gotta get my men in there to help. Oh. If I can get my guy to act, my guys to actually like run through and hit the right guys with the new um Targeting system. It'd be really nice if they would actually kind of try to push past and go after these archers. But we'll see. Um, they might be. I don't know how well it's working. They got a little obliterated, but I don't know if that was troop quality or tactics. <laughs> There's like no more infantry again. Okay, what are we looking at for death zone? Oh, not that bad. It's, it was Aaron's party that really got clobbered. My army must be mostly the uh, archers. Oh, see you later, horse. Okay. 
Put an end to you. Oh, another horse down. Oh, and another kill. Good battle, good battle. Uh, how did we do in terms of kills? We got a lot of kills. It was my... My Cav got a lot of kills. Interesting. The Cav really strong on this one. Okay. Interesting to know. So I don't know if that has to do with the patch or just how the battles have, like turned out, but the Cav really, really overperformed compared to everyone else on my squad. Because there's only... It's only like thir I only had like 30 cab, I think, and they got a significant portion of all my kills. Oh, another one down for the Kuze, dude. That's not good. And he was leading their, he led their, uh, their army. Stop. Curious to see how good he was. Any sturgeons? Okay. Where are all these sturgeons? I don't want to go too crazy. I still want to be a little fast. Oh. Interesting. Okay. A little bit of loot. Not too shabby. Gavon. How good was he? Oh, he didn't have, like, any skills, so he was kind of trash. That's fine. How old are my kids? Four. Three. Not really close. <laughs> okay. So we move on. Where are they going? They're traveling to Super. I think they're regrouping a little bit. Uh, I think we're going to stick around here to defend... Ladiv, if necessary. We're also gonna donate some troops to this guy. Um, we'll give him some, like, decent troops. And some recruits. A little bit of both. I definitely want to stick around here, because I don't imagine they're not, like, I, I, I imagine the Kuzi are not going to like what we just did, and they're going to be coming at us. Oh, this guy's got no relations with me. There you go, buddy. You have tons of relation with me. there yet. I, I really want to level up. Holy! Alright. You know what we can do? We can take all this. Let's talk to the party leader. Let me inspect your troops. All those recruits that you have? Let's swap them out. Swap them out with some, like, decent troops. Now we're talking. Still take 11 more. I keep giving him good troops. Now I hold on to this, these guys. Now we'll fill them up with more recruits and then drop the rest of them. I, I want some space. I still want some good troops. Actually, how, 
Nah, I'm not on the castle. I'll like lose other troops. Oh, that's not what I wanted to hit. <laughs> yeah, no one's recruited from here in a bit, I guess. What quest did they have though? Brigands? Oh, 32 bandits. What the hell? Okay, we're kind of back a little bit. Yeah, we're not like completely trash. We could definitely be better, especially our infantry. Our infantry is really weak. Our archer squad is not large in numbers, but um, still pretty powerful in quality. Like we have 50 Fian champions. We have decent cav. Like all of our cav is pretty good. Oh, another Bebe. Let's go Bebe. I'd really like to pick up these uh, rebe rebelling uh, towns, but it's just... That's something that we're going to have to do during peace. I could take that castle. Oh, I could take Tiao issue is just who's around the corner there's still we really haven't nicked into their strength at all they've been around 5k this entire time and if 5k we're 6k they're 5k so they can easily put together an army bigger than that because they had like 600 400 so they can easily put together a thousand piece army and run me the hell over before i can really siege this down Noble retinues. What does this do? Yeah. I can lose a little influence. Am I tier 5? I must be close if I'm not. Yeah. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Now we're talking here. We can get a even bigger army. Who are these guys? Even bigger army coming our way. Uh, do I do it? We do it. We ride. Oh, do we go ladders up? Do we go ladders up? Where's archers? Let's do it. Let's get the assault going. Now I've done one. I've done a couple of sieges since this patch has happened on, on a live stream, and it was. Horrendous, to say the least. So this could go very poorly. But I think I have stronger archers, so I think I'm gonna tell everyone to chill, chill like way back. Except for my archers, I think I'm gonna put my archers up. Cause they don't have any catapults. So if we can take out their archers. So 
If we can get all my archers kind of like behind cover. And hopefully like ready to ball. I'm going to try to break some shields. And then hopefully we can with our powers combined get some kills. This is the game plan. Oh, that I've never There we go. Oh, hey, keep your shield down, brother. Man, these shields are strong. What the hell? Hey. Oh, that ladder. Let's see if this works. We're inventing new tactics here. Did I hit? Okay, there we go. Ow. Yeah, throw axes at me, brother. No, no, don't you run away, horse. Any more axes on the ground here? Oh, nice, right here. Where are you going there? I didn't tell you to go up there. What the hell is he doing? Warrior! Oh! He got pushed down too? That's so funny. Archers? You're gonna, like, land some shots? Dude, like pushing them down, that's so funny. Okay. Not doing very well in terms of landing any strikes. I'll be honest. So maybe we'll send them in. We'll get them ready. These guys aren't even like really shooting. Which ones are you? We like put them right here. Oh my god, what just happened to that man? <laughs> okay, here we go. Now we're firing. We're kind of getting them now? Still breaking shields. Warriors! Warriors! Hard warriors! At them! So hopefully they go up those ladders. Arrow! Onward! Forward! Bowman! Move! See how they do. Are they charging? Okay, they are trying to go up. Just failing miserably. Maybe with the lack of shields I can punch through. No. What? What? 
Give him hell. Half of them are going back around to the other side, even though. <laughs> okay, whatever. <laughs> I was climb up this wall. So want these guys to just be charging. I don't want them to get up here and then just like kind of glitch out and stand still, which has happened. Oh, all tabbed on accident. <laughs> breaking through and I think I think them not having shields probably actually helped like they did not have a lot of men with shields so I think it definitely it probably helped I don't know I can't be certain couldn't have hurt I didn't really see it it was probably harder for them to set up a really nice blockade for you, brother. I got you! Open the gates, baby. Come on in, brothers. One, baby. Oh, okay, we did take it. Pretty clean, too. When I'm in control, we can get sieges done. Okay, good to know. Good to know. When the AI commands, uh, it gets a little glitchy. But me being able to just tell them to charge and not just, uh, stand on the wall like an idiot, it's pretty big. The men actually did pretty well. Um, nice. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'll take the troops. Um... Definitely take some of these guys. A lordly. Standard of wrath. Increased melee damage. Okay, nothing there. We'll just take the loop. Call it a date. Show mercy. Hello, hello. Start filling up the garrison a little bit. Uh, where were they? Let's get these Imperials in there that I rescued, and we'll get the Sword Sisters. Hello, Sword Sisters. Where you at, Sword Sisters? I know I grabbed you, didn't I? I did, right? What did I grab then? Oh, there they are. Nice. Okay, so let's wait here for a little bit. Actually, let's also recruit. Hell yeah, brother. Do, do, do I want any veteran bowmen? I don't think I do. I 
think my fiends will be enough of archers for me. Well, I think we'll grab them from this side of the tree. Right, let's wait here. I want to see who gets this town. Oh. Nice, and then we can start looking at whatever that's happening. Dang it. Not me. Here. Oh, I almost was able to screw it all up. Give it to some random scrub. Ah, Thaffin. You better do well with it. I'll be pissed if you don't. I worked hard for this. Okay. Um, so, another pretty su su successful episode. Uh, we shall pause here and then uh, try to find a way to deal with this army in the next one. So, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. Peace.